Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play The Seventh Saga. I'm your host, the Game Batarians. Last we left off, we went into the Cave of Silence and managed to make it so as we are not any longer moot and able to cast spells. We also have the Moonlight, which allows us to, in theory, take out this Goriso. Ah, can't wait to do that. So, we're heading towards the castle of Baron and Castle of Gorfalm. Over and to the north. Uh, as soon as we run away from things. Nope. Uh, as soon as we run away. Nope. Uh, as soon as we. Okay. I think he wants to. Oh, right. I didn't swap out my cloaks. That's fine. We're fine. We're good. We're okay. That's just... And being able to spam lesser healing spells is real nice. Anyways, Castle Gorfun uh, is to the north. Well, we shall... Oh, God, you again? Well, we shall face many a trial in order to get to Gorsia himself, and hope that the moonlight works in banishing him from whence he came. Oh, more opals. <laughs> now, that said, I don't think that there's anything in particular in the castles, in the castle, that I really have to worry about too much. I think. Not entirely sure. But there is a wizard room there. And that is the final room that I need to gain my youth. Because apparently I'm old for it. Maybe, maybe just old for a dwarf. I'm going to go with the fact that I might just be old for a dwarf. <laughs> if that makes any sense. So, we are in a cave. It is icy. Uh, there's actually not much to this cave itself. Like, I can get lost here. Also, Gurgen. Grr. Gurgen, Gurgen, Durgens. Ah, uh, we'll give him the common courtesy of most bosses. Moon, sky, at the least. Oh god, he absorbs HP. That sucks. Oh no, my MP. Ah. That might be a problem. <laughs> Even buffed up, I only do that much damage. That is not, uh, as they say, good. Can I use multiple instances of light room? Nope. Okay. And he drops rocks. That's... yeah. A little... Mm. Alright. Fire 2. Yeah, strangely enough, the Gurgen is weak against fire. What is it, the Sky Rune? Yeah. No. Oh boy. I we might be here a while if this guy is going to be this annoying. Fire two. Fire two. Haha. Uh -huh. I have things against that. I'm gonna use the sky rune again. Uh, I won't lie. This is a little tedious. This... This guy has got to be the reason why Olven has the Fire Tube spell, because otherwise it... Did I just take 62 damage? Uh, fine. Bottles of Agility. Oh, he might be able to dodge things. 
Yeah, like that. I do. Oh, you bastard. You're prevented. I really hope that I have enough mirrors for this fight. Dodging, dodging, dodging. Using fire to wing. This is definitely not a place where I could have sworn that I would see myself playing as Olven. Freaking using fire spells against a dragon. Oh no, I ran out of mirrors. Okay, I dodged that second one though. That's fine. Just, just gotta remember to stock back up on mirrors when I next get the opportunity to. In the meantime, fire two! Okay, one... Okay. One more good fire two. That'll do the trick. There we go. Whew. Won't lie, that actually did give me a worry when I saw... <laughs> when I saw the damage I did just... Aha! And then... One. Oh. We're either gonna be here a while or I need to change my tactics. Okay. That's... that's fine. We're fine. I'm gonna go up these stairs. And we're, and we're gonna be fine. Oh god. Is it another castle? Sir, how many castles do you need? Uh. This... Hold the phone. One second, folks. Okay, I think I got a grasp of things now. <laughs> Sorry if I sound a little bit confused. It's it's one of those sort of places where it's like, um, because there's a lot of smaller rooms, and if you miss, uh, if you decide to dive into some place that you don't think is the place that you need to go. I'm um, probably not where I need to go. I don't need to go here, but I want treasure. As per usual. Oh, you're new. You're very new. Uh, let me guess. Cashmere. Chimere. Some sort of chimera. I wasn't wrong. Still based off of the same naming scheme. Don't quite know why the hell they chose that naming scheme, though. Ah, well. Just need to be more careful around them. They do a lot of damage, and... HP suck. Always sucks. Eh? Eh? Hmm. Eh? Damn it. Okay, fine. Okay, less fine. You wanna fight? You wanna go? You wanna have a brawl? Miss me. Missed you. Stop lowering my defense. That's honestly the least fun tactic. I'd rather you... Wait. Right, okay. Oh, so that's annoying. So, when you get your defense lowered, if you use something that increases your defense again, it just re uh, brings it back to basic. Which is fine, just annoying. Especially when they keep on using freaking MP shite like that. How many. Yeah. I don't think I got much of a. Much of an opportunity, rather, to really do anything about this besides just keep on increasing my defense. Go with the moon rune. See if I can't hasten this a little bit. Oh no, my already zero MB. You'd swear. You'd swear. Uh, I I really do like that. They try to suck out your MP when you have none. Oh god.
Oh, it's just a killer trick. King trick, whatever trick. It's dead trick. That's fine. Go pass. Entering the bowels of hell. Here, have a toe pass. Okay, come on. Get down there. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm remembering this. Whole hell of a lot of this. Like three or four times. Enix games tended to do this a lot. Where they were just like, alright. Let's have them go back and forth, back and forth, up and down ladders. Power seed? Harp? That'll be good. I'm kind of wishing that I... Okay, that's a fort. Now, I could... Hmm. Will that bring me back to the entrance of the ice cave? Only one way to find out. Okay. That's actually rather generous. I thought it was going to bring me completely out of the ice cave as well. I just didn't want to walk all the way back up again. I, w I didn't care too much about the enemies. I just really didn't want to do that uh, zigzaggy walk back up. Always utilize your items, folks. You can always buy more. That is, that is the lesson that Darius shares today. Uh, I'm gonna heal my MP. I don't have much to use for. Where's my. Am I out? Am I out or is it. It's lower. Ha! Ah, I'm smart. Is that, this place is actually a lot bigger than I seem to remember it being. There it is. Which is fine. Um. Kind of were really wish that I knew where I was. Okay, let's see where I am. Ah, uh, all right. Now, uh, there's a whole lot of empty rooms here. Just full disclosure, it's just filled with nothing. It's more of a maze, which is understandable. Or not maze, so much as it just has a lot of... Nothing in them. The whole purpose is to make it look like this place probably had uh, people in it. Or, at the least, places to rest for those people. But... I'm gonna ignore those rooms, because there's literally nothing in them. Like, one of them has a bed. That's about it. I do like it when games decide to make it like uh, look kind of like things have been lived in. I take that. I understand that. I respect that. Um, is this a thing or is this not a thing? It's probably not a thing. And I'm heading towards my desk. As long as I use the moon rune, I should be able to kill these things in roughly three turns. Uh. Okay. I'm always just worried. Because <laughs> uh, it's not like defense down reduces your defense to zero. Uh, kind of like how using a defense up will double your defense. What it does is it halves your defense, which is still annoying. The bed looks very comfortable. Okay. Heading this way was more or less useless. 4,000 experience points until I level up again. Kind of ridiculous. Another one of you? Sure, why not? At this point, I think it's easier, a lot less painful to just... that. Against the Chimere. Mm. Still a funky name. Alright, pop in here. Whew. Here we go. It has been roughly a year since I've done this fight again. You are ugly. Sinfully ugly. Are you Elven? 
congratulations. I'm surprised that you have made it this far. I would honor your display of courage, but I'm about to put an end to it. Oh no. I can't see him. I better buff myself up first. Ooh, good thing I did that one first. Oh, I should have done... Should have done light first. Just in case it suddenly decides to cast a spell. That said, I don't know what... Fire spells. Got it. Thanks. I, uh... I'll prepare myself for that now. Fire. You son of a devious bitch. Alright. Don't matter which one I use. Got it. I should pop the agility seeds, or agility seeds, agility bottles before I go on the offensive. Because like this, you cannot hit him. Like, he'll just, there will be an attack animation, then nothing. Now, at the least, if I can dodge the fire stuff. But no, um, at this point, yeah. I can take the fire damage, I can't take the ice damage. <sighs> Guiding Moonlight, guide me! Yep, sinfully ugly. Oh god, you take... Uh, he's visible for like two or three turns, and then he turns invisible once more. It'd be a little bit less tedious if the Moonlight item was not all the way down in the bottom of my freaking inventory. Oh, and you have vacuum too. That's great! I'm sure my, my viewers loved having eardrums at one point. So vacuum 2 works a lot like vacuum 1. Except, uh, with the one caveat of it affects the entire party, and not just one party member. Okay, I do relatively good damage, just regularly. I'd rather get a little bit of good damage in... ...then... ...just, you know, defend, attack, defend, and then he disappears. Because he does that. Oh no, he knows how to pitch that. At this point, I'm gonna potion three though. Cause ice spells might kill me. Aha! I really hope he doesn't heal. <laughs> ah, if there's one thing more de if there is anything more demoralizing than watching your opponent heal himself from like a tenth of his HP? I'd like to know. Okay, he's invisible one more time. Get him back to this world. Aren't the least invisible on this one? Get bit slapped? Get slapped on my back. That is a lot of experience points. Woo! 33. 5, 5, 3, 4. My magic's not great, but it's still a little bit better than my attack power. Yes, the seventh rune. I can become young again. <laughs> You've returned all the runes to me. Well done. All the runes are broken into pieces. The power has finally returned to me. It's free from the runes. You don't understand, do you? After all, I trained each of you. Emily has been dead for five years. I took care of him when I arrived here. I came from the past through the my through a time tunnel. My name is Gorsia. Thanks to your efforts, I've regained my power. Now I will avenge my exile and imprisonment. And for that, I do not need you. I banish you into the darkness.
Sorrow, I can't wait to see you prepare to die. <laughs> He's been unconscious for seven days. Don't worry, the wounds are healing. Are you awake? I was worried because you were unconscious for seven days straight. I don't know what exactly happened, but you were injured and unconscious when we found you. Whew. Oh, I had a strangest dream that, uh, of course you had popped out of nowhere and just freaking sent me to the dark world. Or something like that. I was hot-headed too when I was young. I... I'm apparently old. Don't know if I'm old for a dwarf, but I'm old. You're new around here. Where are you from? Uh, Pang. Ever heard of it? Nope. Dwarven place. Really cool. Makes the best weapons. It's a terrible time because the two worlds, light and dark, are fighting. There's nothing we can do about it. Uh, what did I miss? Monsters will have to return to the Dark World now that Gorsi is gone. What? But he just returned. What? I'm glad you've recovered. I never heard of the towns and countries you've mentioned. Where did you come from? Ow. At this point? Might have all just been a dream. I heard that Sauron defeated Gorsia. The so peace and prosperity will return to us. And then that's probably where it should start be clicking. Wherein we are in the past. It's been a while since the two worlds have collided. Well. Well, this is about par for the course for fantasy. Hey, who uh, who else probably has sent their D D party back in time to? Um, varying effectiveness in what the hellery. What the hell? Hmm. Hmm. I feel like I do. Well, do they have uh, better weapons in the past? There's a selection of weapons. They do! Oh god. <laughs> okay. Sure. I'll take it. Well. I don't think the. Sh yeah, still the Mystic Shield, which is. Oh no. Only two. Gotta help. <laughs> That's a little mean. Hmm, better rest though. You know, after just waking up, it's important to rest. Oh yeah, and the runes. Gone. Map? Well, it's... I can't use it here, but it's useless. Which makes a little bit no sense. Because it's still magic. I'm the one who found you. Couldn't believe it when I found you were struck... Stuck... The... Uh, Lightning struck you. It hurts. Don't don't get struck by lightning. Pretty much what I'm pretty sure he was trying to say. Name of this town? It's Ferrano. Where are you from? Pang. Like the pangs of pain. I heard that sorrow defeated Gorsia. I'm relieved. We're safe. Anyone have any directions for me? Anyone? Did you? No, you didn't. You just said you were thankful that I got out of there alive. If you go south, you'll find a large town called Pasanda. It will take a while to get there. Well, it... Oh, man. Alright. In which case, I'm gonna go ahead and call an episode after sleeping again. This dwarf likes his sleep. When we return, we're going to go south to Pasanda. And during that time, I will also have used the seeds in my inventory again. Well, seed in my inventory again. So, thank you everyone so very much for watching. 
Hope you guys are enjoying the series as much as I'm loving playing it. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers.